Hello gang, I'm back. Um, I recently got a bass guitar. Uh, it's pretty awesome. I like walked into the pawn store. Um, well, I was at this. I was thinking myself, you know, for the while I've been really wanting a bass guitar because uh, I've been uh, when I record tracks and they have like options to play, um, you know, electric drums, electric guitar, uh, synths. Um, violins, all kinds of stuff, and one of them is uh, for electric bass, and it just sounds really weird. And like, if it was, if I was making like an EDM track or something, <coughs> electronic dance music track or something, then it would it would work out. It'd be okay. But honestly, even then, I would want to use like a, what is it? Practical, practical bass, which is the online one, the electric one. Hmm. Computer. Uh. Anyways. <clears throat> so yeah, I went and was like, okay, I live near a pawn shop, so uh, I was like, okay, I'm gonna go to this pawn shop if they have a bass guitar, you know, and see if they have any bass guitars, and um, if they have one for you know 50 bucks, because that's all I had on me, then I'm, I'm gonna get it. <laughs> like, hands down. Went into the pawn shop. Uh, they have all kinds of stuff. They have like, from gadgets to gizmos to movies to amps to pieces to drum kits. <coughs> so, and of course, bunch of guitars and basses. So I'm like, oh shit, there's basses. And I found one that was, you know, they were all pretty much like a hundred bucks. And like I said, I only had like fifty bucks on me. So. When I found the, uh, I found this one for like 70 bucks. Let me show you what it looks like. It looks, it looks like the older brother to my, my, my Sanic, which is, a, this one's a Squire. Let's see, the name right here, Squire. And, um, it's, a, it's pretty decent for, for 70 bucks. It was on sale. It was 100 or something, but then they dropped down the price. And uh, then I was like, "Hey, dude," because I didn't have seven. I was gonna have seven bucks. I mean, I was like, "Hey, dude, can I can I get this guitar for like fifty bucks?" So that's all I have on me. And he's like, "Yeah, dude, let's make this stuff final." I was like, "Fuck yeah!" Because I I needed a bass guitar. So yeah, got me a bass guitar. Sounds rad. I'm gonna play a little bit of some freestyle bass and yeah, enjoy! <laughs>
I think that's about it for uh, 
this freestyle slash um I'll probably post like another video or so. Super excited. I'm gonna head out to the show tonight. Support some friends. Uh South Pasanata hitting subset and a friend of theirs, Televangelist, which I have yet to hear, which I'm really excited to hear them because I haven't I don't I haven't heard them yet. And uh of course, Cian Bar, which is cool, because they're a group, I guess, I don't know if Will Swan formed a band, but I, it's like a side band, I, I guess. Will Swan is the guitarist for um, Dance Game and Dance, which is my, my favorite band. Uh, yeah. I'm really excited to see them. Got my ticket. Got my my money. Got my deodorant. Um. What else do I have? I'm just ready for. That's it. And my ID. And money. Oh, I'm gonna try to get a shirt. I really wanna try to get a shirt. Cause I don't have a white band shirt. Plus, they're like new and upcoming. We're well, not completely new and upcoming, but new and upcoming. Let's just say that. They're gonna be huge one day. I can see it. Yeah. So, South Pasanata, gonna check them out tonight, uh, support the band, support friends, and have a bitchin' time. And then a month, not a month, technically, it's like two months, because it's like, towards the end of that month. We have, we have September, the full month of September, and practically the full month of uh, October, so it's basically two months. Two months from now, I'm gonna be going to see Dance Game Dance like, probably for like the fourth time. Uh, yeah, first time was at Warp Tour. Second time. And that was the second time. I think I like, I missed them, but they were at they were at South by Southwest, and then no, that after South by Southwest, I saw them at Warp Tour. And then, I didn't see them again after that because Johnny Craig had left the band. And so they were kind of, they weren't really playing any shows because they didn't have anybody to play with. And then they got Tillian. Which I saw him accepting, so that's like three more, so yeah. This will probably be like. Is that one time? Another time. Like my fifth time seeing them. Fourth or fifth time. I, I don't know. I'm not gonna keep track anymore because I just. They're so fun to watch and like I have the greatest time seeing them. And yeah. I met Tillian one time, and he gave me a hug, and we like, chat for like two seconds, which was pretty chill. And then, turn this off. Uh, and then after seeing them at, like, that one show, I didn't see them for a while. Until they did the reunion tour with JC and uh, Kurt Travis and of course Tillian, which was bomb as f. It was so awesome. They played like originals. They played classics. They played um, together. Like they sang together. Oh, it was so fucking fun. So awesome. So glad I went to that show. That's where I met Tillian. It's the reunion tour. It's the tenth anniversary of DGD, which was fucking bomb. So much fun. And, uh, 
yeah. So they're coming out with a new album, which I'm so psyched for because I heard one of their one of their tracks off that record, and it is I'm cheesing off because it's really good and it makes me feel like hmm, I'm glad, I'm glad I like this band because they kind of they know what they're doing even after, you know, uh, vocalists have been in and out of the band, they seem to know what they're doing so. Kudos, Dance Cam and Dance. Kudos. Uh, I don't know who signed this. No one signed it, really. Doesn't kind of, kind of see. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try this. See if it works. Nope. Oh, I guess. I guess it kind of works. Yeah, it does kind of work. So yeah. There's a signature. I don't know who. From this angle, it kind of looks like Adolf, which I did not get a pick from Hitler. I. Um. <sighs> yeah, I don't support dominance. No, I don't support dictatorship. Here we go. A total totalitarianism. That's how you say it. Oh, they're still here. The and I don't know where I get most of this cake. Um, I totally lost track of what I was talking about. After I mentioned that guy. Fuck. Oh yeah, Hitler. Um what's this Joshua? Do not support or like monarchy. I don't I don't really I'm not really into monarchy. Which is take something. Because I like British people. And I want to visit the UK one day. It's a bit of a dream there. Anyway, so this is a this is going on to a twenty minute video. I hope it loads. I'm gonna stop it here. I'm gonna continue talking in the next video. Peace.